What's up, YouTube? It's Jay. All right, guys, so uh, really stoked. We're just about to break a 1,000 subscribers, which is amazing. I want to thank all you guys for uh, subscribing and hanging in there with us. We are getting some more videos ready. And in the meantime, I want to put it out to you guys to vote. So put your vote below. We're just we're, uh, getting in the stage of finishing up the toolbox that you guys voted for for the restoration. I got done soaking it in Evaporust and was looking at it and it's got a really cool patina. So my question is, before I strip the paint off and am committed to paint this, uh, I wanted to get your guys' votes down below in the comments section of uh, if you think I should paint it, strip the old paint and paint it, or leave the patina and just clear coat it. And then uh, once we hit that thousand subscriber mark, we're going to be giving this toolbox away. To somebody uh, who would like to have an old craftsman vintage toolbox. So let me show you what it looks like now. That's out of the Evapo Rust. And it looks like it has an old sort of wrinkle finish on it, which I wasn't able to find a newer wrinkle finish in this color. They only had like a silver. So that's what she looks like. And I was just going to clean it up, clear coat it, put some oil on the hinges, you know, handles good. Maybe uh, clean these up a little bit. But I kind of dig just the uh, used patina look. So let me, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. If you say strip it and paint it or leave it patinaed. Um, I love when you guys give us feedback and I appreciate all your comments and really appreciate all you guys subscribing, man. We're very close to the 1000 mark. So thank you all so much. And we do have some more content coming for you soon. All right, guys. Later.